So you put a new engine in the car and you want to check the ignition timing to make sure that it's right. So once you have Tune open and you've opened the package from the car, you're live to the car with the cable connected between the laptop and the car. You're going to go from the Race Functions tab down to Initial Setup. Under Initial Setup, you're looking for the Ignition Configuration tab. And on the Ignition Configuration screen, you're looking for Reference Offset Crypt Test. There's three values here. Number one is the Engine Speed Reference Offset. The Engine Speed Reference Offset tells the ECU how far it is from the reference tooth to top dead center compression number one. The Ignition Test uh, is a pull-down, actually, you can use to do multiple things, but in this case, we're going to use it to check timing. And the third parameter is the ignition test timing. Now, this number can be whatever you want between 0 and 20, 0 being top dead center, 15 being 15 before, wherever you have a mark. Or you can leave it at 20 and use the dial back on your timing light if you want. So you start the engine, point the timing light down at the crankshaft. You should see 20 degrees on your timing light. Or if you have a mark at 20 and the timing light dial is at 0, it should line up with the 20 mark. If it does not line up, you change the engine speed reference offset number until it does line up. Once it's lined up perfectly and you're happy with it, you're going to go out of check timing mode back to disabled. And then don't forget to save up here in the upper left. If you don't save it, when you disconnect the laptop, the ECU will revert back to the old offset number. 